Give me H's 47 here. And welcome back to Assassin's Creed Revelations. We are maneuvering about to the... Trying to get the next key. So far, so good. We've been able to safely navigate the area. Go, go, go. Nice. Oh, I could actually have side jump there, huh? part of why you play this game, because it's fun. It's super fun. The climbing bits are just awesome. <coughs> Similarly, uh, actually, is Tomb Raider, which I get to, once I finish this, I'm going to do another 30, uh, 30 or so Skyrim videos, and then we'll go on to next games. I might do more games than more, more Skyrim videos than that. Yeah. Oh yeah. <clears throat> oh man, I totally forgot. I'm uploading. I'm uploading. It's probably done uploading too. Awkward. B. There it is. Yes. <laughs> He's very, very trusting man. What? No. Maybe there might have been something there, but there's not. There is not. Okay. That was pretty lame of you. Ha cha cha. Defend the cities are being successfully completed all over the place. Yeah, that's why I couldn't jump up, because it was, uh... Yeah! I had no... I wasn't even trying for the six minutes. get the, like, blatantly obvious treasure before I try and find the, the fake, or the, the secret door. It's not, it's not fake, but it is rather secret. 
There's a... There's a... Uh, about 90% sure it's right there. Oh, what? That's... Oh, I see it now. Derp. Derpy hooves. Think that that dude would be trapped or something like an Indiana Jones, <laughs> or that some a-hole would be hanging out outside. You leave, but we want your key. We have so and so hostage, or we'll kill. Blah blah blah. Although I guess to be fair, Ezio could uh, take just about anybody, especially now. Now he's got the sweet, sweet assassin armor. I hey, re dyed my clothes. I probably don't have a choice now. I probably can't dye my clothes. I could go try to, I guess. My sweet Venetian crimson color is, is not in this game. There are a few that are pretty close, but. I actually do like the royal purple. It's nice. Yeah. Hey guys. You guys having fun? Yeah. Cool story, bro. No. Uh, how far away is this thing? Yeah, we'll go ahead and do it now. Oh, it's just the it's the memory, right? We need to go do some more <coughs> Altair business. That's a good question, my friend. That's a good, good, solid question. Hey. Testicles. Always good. Is, that, is this is this actually climbable right here? No. I mean, technically, yes, but uh, as far as game physics go, no. Butterflies in the sky. What? Dude. Come on, man. Seriously, what was that about? Thank you. Stupid. Stupid head. Ah. Uh, I don't know. No. Of course not. It's just an idea, really. Just trying it on, as it were. I wish the hook could be used as uh, one of those climbing uh, platoon platoons. Is that what they're called? That you like stick into the rock wall. That lets you hook hook into stuff and be all awesome. No. Leave me alone, ladies. I'm none of your business. You kind of freak me out. Yes. We'll wait until we have, like, I don't know, another, uh, 150,000 or so. Try and get around maybe three, maybe even, yeah. So I'll wait around until I get around 300,000. Alki, algae, whatever the hell the, 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 I, I key? Whatever the hell the money's called. Anyway. 
Wait. No, it's this way. Before I... I'm gonna go around and buy up all the... Things. Buildings. What the freak? What are they called? It'll come to me later. Like, works of wonder, places of wonder, places that need to be repaired, and all that. Altair. We are going to Altair. That would explain the scar on his mouth. If we're reliving the memories as of Altair as Ezio, then that's probably a little bit of bleeding effect. That's weird. I lost my sound. At least we have the t the text. Forgive me for this mentor, but the apple, blah blah blah. For to live, you had to die. Is it truly over? Is that sorcerer dead? Yes. He was no sorcerer. Just an ordinary man in command of illusions. Have you prepared the pyre? I have, but... Altair, some of the men will not stand for such a thing. Let me handle it. Yeah. Give him an honorable burial, so to speak. Not burial, but a uh, funeral. Make sure... Yeah. Don't lose any more than three? What, am I about to be attacked while I'm moving this guy in? Are you fit to travel? Well enough, yes. I asked Malik to ride to Jerusalem with news of Al-Mulim's death. Mm. You ride to Akre and do the same. Of course. That is not the right way. Can I not jog? So much confusion. What is happening? Someone is having a little fun in the crowd. Ah. How did it come to this? <laughs> uh, sorry. My mind was clear, but my body... It's it kind would of a dirty not mind. Is our mentor the cause of this confusion? Let's go! I do not believe <laughs> I'm very sad. What has happened here? Our mentor deceived us all. The Templars corrupted him. Where is your proof? Walk with me, Abbas, and I will explain. And if I find your answers wanting, I will talk until you are satisfied. Yes. Do you remember the artifact we recovered from Robert de Saab in Solomon's temple? The artifact you were sent to retrieve, but others delivered? Yes. yes. It is a Templar tool. The Apple of Eden. It can conjure illusions and control men's minds. A deadly weapon. And you believe yes. Al Moalim fell under its spell? I do. Today he used the apple to enslave Masyaf. You saw that for yourself. I do not know what I saw. Listen, Abbas. The apple is safe in Al Moalim's study. When I'm finished here, I will show you all I know. Very intense moment. Oh. Oh. Nice crispy sword. No! I must know that he cannot return. But this is not our way. To burn a man's body is forbidden. Defiler! Hear me out. Defilers. This body could be another one of Al Mulim's phantoms. I must be certain. Nice! All your life, you have made a mockery of our creed. No. You bend the rules to suit your whims. Not really. Well, belittling and humiliating those around you. I'm only sent Altair. 
Did you not kill Al-Mualim a bunch of yos that he didn't know were actually good? Or like, not good, but they weren't as bad as as, as he was being uh, led. You can't just go I will do anything. I can just take care of you. Alright, you win! Oh no. We could be friends. Just let me go, no? Stay away from me! Ah! I am I am too sorry! Stop it! You guys are mean. Oh. Okay, is that it? It's fine, I was just what did I tell you, Altair? Abbas, stop! What did you think would happen when you murdered our beloved mentor? You loved Al Malim less than anyone. You blamed him for all your misfortune, even your father's <laughs> suicide. My father was a hero. This is not the time to quarrel over the past. We must decide what to do with that weapon. Whatever this artifact is capable of, you are not worthy to wield it. No man is. He's right. He's beautiful. It's <laughs> like the one ring, man. It corrupts everyone who grabs it. <laughs> Tard. You don't pick up the evil, nasty weapon, man. What? Ah! Oh, that's just stupid. I'm coming. Uh. As best I can. If you keep slowing me down with your crazy applesauce. Wait. Yeah. Uh. Oof. Oh, uh, oh dear. No, 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 no. <clears throat> yeah. Scheiße. <laughs> what was it? Are they dead? Mm, no. Forgive me. I did not know. Have you anything to teach us? Be careful, man. Or would you lead us all to ruin? Precious. It has become precious to me. It cannot be destroyed. I mean, you'd think you'd try to destroy something like that. I mean, it doesn't even cross their mind. They just want to hide it. And that's cool and everything, but ultimately, if you're trying to have it not be used by anyone, you want to destroy it. Although sometimes that's not really a feasible thing to do. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Do, do, do. <gasps> do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. It's a nice memory. It's cool. Cool, cool, cool. Done in sequence too. Altair, barely twenty-six, and already oh, a grandmaster grand in command of a divided order. divided order. How does one cope with such responsibility and unlimited power? 
That is the question. That is the question. It's a big question. Really. What's that? A page. Book, book, book. Wow. Bunches. But alright. I like it. Is there... Well... I don't know how much faster it would be. Uh, we haven't left yet, have we? Good. I've got a fast travel point in here. There it is. I know where it is now. Good. We've learned the maze! It's, uh... Right there. Ghoul Kami'i. The Ghoul Kami'i. And stuff. Whew! Shiveries. Weird. <laughs> Shiver me timbers. <laughs> Not really. That's the fourth one. That's the fourth one. Where we become pirates? actually dual purpose here we can uh, we can buy the place that's right here before we climb up to get the, the book scope out where the book is kind of a deal climb that up kinda <laughs> most entertaining you sir are very naughty no well, I guess technically, yeah, but you know. The Rose Mask. Yeah. It now belongs to me. <laughs> or at least, yeah. When it says purchased, it's mine. Which means I should be able, as the owner, to climb and sit on its roofs for as long as I want. Yes. That's right. Come on. Stop at. Hmm. I don't even see. Ah! Really? Is there only one? I mean, it's fine. I have no qualms with that. It's just strange. Which book is this? Church 1. Right. Oh, the Canterbury Tales. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I really like the Canterbury Tales. They're, they're, they're quite good. If only Old, uh... <coughs> Jeffrey Chaucer. He disappeared. Nobody knows what happened to him. He's like... Yeah, like, it's totally... crazy. Uh, Terry Jones... Is it Jones? That's his name? Terry? One of the, the Monty Python guys, anyway, wrote a book about it called Who Who Killed Jeffrey Chaucer? Because chances are pretty high that 
he was in fact removed. Uh, was made to disappear essentially because he was uh, he wasn't very well liked because he put people that he knew <coughs> in his stories, kind of like Dante Alighieri. <coughs> Just goes to show you, man. Just goes to show you. Hmm. What if I can get in there and eat yet? It'd be good. It'd be a good thing to do. Oh. What's that? It's Peary Rays. Yeah. No book stuff over here. I mean, outside of, like, the bookstore. What's this? Oh, books. Yeah. We're gonna start making our. We're gonna make our way around. I'm gonna actually record these because it's cool to see what book shows up. Anyway, until then, Bumblebee Tuna, and we'll see you next video.